Oh, I just woke up like 15 minutes ago. All right, we're starting. We're starting. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's gonna get kicked. <laughs> oh my god. He's gonna kill him. He's gonna kill him. <laughs> oh my god. They, 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 gotta let the they gotta let the shareholders know, man. <laughs> oh my god. Seems like our cards better be strong and epic. <laughs> it's like, I'll let you go this time. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Damn, she stepped over him. Oh my god. You can't do that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> the staff's reviving him. <laughs> like, is he okay? Yeah, he seems to be good, so let's start. Oh, producer revived. Oh my god. Whoa. He's in a suit, dripped out. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Not even the same guy? It's <laughs> not <laughs> <laughs> a twist? Uh, he got the drip, dude. <laughs> oh, Blue Archive! Oh shit! That's a new mobile That's game new that everyone's game, boosting. Right? <laughs> Alright, trial deck releasing on the 22nd of April, booster pack on the 20th of May. Ooh, Tachibana Rika. Wait, oh, Grand Blue! Let's go, Grand Blue! Let's go, Grand Blue! Let's go, GBF! Come on! Dude, GBF. Oh, You're losing a man. <laughs> we are used to seeing her. <laughs> oh, oh pre Connect. Yeah, Pricone, yeah. Uh, Everyone's favorite. <laughs> Beer consuming. <laughs> voice actress. It's pre I'm safe. Right. Pre cool, I'm safe. Mom, Please be I'm GBF. Safe. Please be GBF. Please be GBF. I kind of want us to be GBF too. <laughs> this is TV? A trailer. Uh oh. Grab blue, grab blue, grab blue, grab blue. Oh no. <gasps> grab blue. <gasps> no. <laughs> Wait. Wait. No, it's not. Stop. Oh, it's Pre Okay, 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 okay. okay. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Side games of Bushiroad. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Alright, up next is the Vanguard announcements. So this is their main jobs, honestly. Vanguard overdress. Alright, so don't forget the hashtag Bushibakto. And hashtag Vanguard. Might as well hashtag BRO2021 as well. Yeah, hashtag BRO2021. <laughs> don't forget to sign up for BRO2021. Oh, Mori P! Hey. Mori P is coming on. All right. Ooh, oh, what a drip, dude. Oh, oh, man. 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 Alright, so please look forward to the announcement of the next producer and the roadmap for Vanguard going forward. I'd like everyone to keep cheering on the Vanguard project, product and the Vanguard project from here on out as well. Thank you so much for everything you've done, Modi P. Thank you for everything you've done. Or oh, next, the Japanese version producer. Watanabe Ryota. Alright, so Japanese, Japanese version. version producer. Watanabe Ryota. Hey! Okay. Two versions. So, like, as a user, I've been playing Vanguard since it came out. That's good to hear. Alright, so he's entering 
as the Japanese version producer. That's a good, that's pretty cool that we'll have producers for like, uh, you know, or like multiple. Yes, that's very big. Actually, very big, I think. It means they're actually recognizing they're going to work together with the English producer and the Japanese producer. Yes. <laughs> Chris is the English <laughs> That's cool. Like, this means that the game is continuing to look at the global scale. Let's introduce the English producer for the game. Dude, this is really we have a video from the from the producer. Ooh. Oh! Hello, I am Shinichi Taira, the it's Taira -san. English producer. First, I would like to thank everyone for your continuous support. Uh, I have been involved in the promotion, uh, English Vanguard project since <laughs> Taira -san, oh my god! And I am honored to take on the role as the English producer. We'll be working very closely with the team in Japan to Let's bring the go, best man. possible experience for all of the players uh, worldwide. And I would also like to share that we have a Bushy Road English Conference Winter 2021 uh, that's coming up soon. Uh, you can find details of the date and time on our website. But this is where we share uh, big announcements about our English trading card games. So please uh, do check that out. However, I do have uh, one major announcement that I can share with everyone here Pretty today. Good. So we have a new collaboration title oh, that's okay. coming out for English Vanguard next year. And that title is Record of Ragnarok. Ooh. So this highly popular title is coming next year with the release of the title trial deck as Ooh, well as the title booster cards. English and I'm looking exclusive? forward to seeing how this title will be represented. It was announced in on the Japanese stream, so I'm I, I don't think so. As excited as I am. Uh, more details about this product will be coming soon, so uh, please do look out for that. As wow. Well. Uh, again, thank you. Ooh, and okay. Please enjoy the rest of this press conference. Okay. Wow, I'm so happy for Taira san. I, wow. That's crazy because, like, I first met him at my first ever regionals in 2012. Yeah. That's cool. He's been around for a while, man. Yeah. He's been in Bushwood for a very long time, and he's been, like, close with Vanguard for a very long time. <laughs> That's good. This is good. I, I, like, I like this. I like this. Right. Ooh, so I'm guessing it's going to be simultaneous release. Chinich Taira is like he he was he's the CEO of Bushroad NA as well, I believe. Alright, so of course this set is also in Yep. English Japanese edition on the same day. That's cool. So it's Shubatsu no Warkyure is the is the Japanese title. Nice. For both Taira san and the the new Japanese producer, this will be a lot of work. To be a lot of a lot of things. I think people saying we lost the voice of Mori. We still have a voice on the English scene as well. I think it's actually relieving. The oh, restriction. All right, restriction lists. There we go. No changes. No changes for all three formats. Including V. Including V. Alright, so there'll be more information on the homepage. But I, everyone kind of knew this. Everyone knew that there wouldn't be any restrictions after the last yeah, nuclear ban list. It's way too soon. I don't know what you guys were. were. Vanguard oh, Zero, alright. <laughs> roadmap, roadmap, zero show me a roadmap. Alright. We're in the second anniversary. We're giving away a total of 324 cards throughout this month. Is this when they count all the fighters collection? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They count every single card that you open for fighters collection. Chronos Epic. Cray Cross Epic. Yeah. Cray Cross Epic. So this is the lore site. Please watch this video. Cross Epic.
All right, it's a trailer for the Cross Epic lore. Yeah, one of them had big zongers, man. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so we've seen these designs a while ago. So these are the main characters of the of the lore. Cross Epic. Ooh. Fire, Legaris, so the Drag Ritter Girl, Radirina, and the Bioroid Young Man, Lorawa. Oh, look at that. Whoa. Tegria. <laughs> Alright, so these will appear in the story. They are very important characters. Yeah, very important. Very important. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Alright. Oh no, we're covering cover the link to Ogre Girl. The yeah. anime is really good right now. Everyone catch up on Overdress Anime. Season 2 is amazing. To see the new cards. Alright. Aoi Shota. Two Gramble Fantasy voice actors in one stream. Yes. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's always a treat. Always a treat. <laughs> oh, so cute. <laughs> Dora! Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Here he is. Oh. God, what the what are all my Holy shit, that's so based. Wait a second, I unplugged my headset so box. <laughs> is it a cap? I don't think it's a cap. I think... No, it is a cap. I can see, I can see it. <laughs> oh my god. That's so good. Hey, what's up, East? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What a god. Yeah, I can see the lines. It's a cap, yeah. So it's like, does everyone already know? Have you seen the episode already? <laughs> it's like, I'm the one talking. I'm the one talking. <laughs> Seraph Pure Light, yeah. Bastion Prime. Prime. Twitch Prime, let's go! Bastion Twitch Prime. <laughs> Thank you, Bastion Prime. Ooh! Ooh! Dude! Oh! SSR! Yo! That is clean! Damn! Oh, they're with the voice actor signs. Oh! <laughs> Damn, that's clean. Wow, that is so clean. All right, we're getting into new product information. Whoa. All right, Shaman King Title Booster Volume 2. Wow. All right, 22nd of April. Shaman King is here to stay, boys. Yeah, we already know this. All right, and one more. Product. Ten. Booster. Oh, okay. Set five. Set five. Will be okay. So on the first of April, the fifth set will have a special product to celebrate the tenth anniversary. Okay. Oh, so all right. So the the weekly Tuesday stream that will air on the fourth of January will give us information for uh, for lyrical monastery set two, set five, and all that stuff. I'm assuming it's the next encounter set. I'm assuming it's going to have encounters. All right, first check out this visual. Oh, Kidani. Alright, welcome all Bushiro Card Game fans. I am Bushiro Kidani. <laughs> so yeah, the creator of Bushirod. Alright. So ever since we got into Corona, we haven't been able to 
determines properly. Alright, so he wants to do events, you know, with like special corners with guests. You know, for Kidani, this means a lot to be able to go back to normal WGP events. And he wants to keep. <laughs> He's like, I'm not giving this, a, giving this away, though. <laughs> so, yeah, this is his, like, announcement for, you know, bringing back IRL events, coming back to regionals. So, it's like, I'll be waiting for you in the stage, in the event hall. Alright. Tenth anniversary World Grand Prix. So that feeling of being in the fighting area is coming back. Dude, this is the first time we've done a trailer for WGP. Is it? I don't think it is. I think so. Right? All right. So this will be in ten different regions. All over Japan. Alright, so 25th and 26th December is Tokyo. 16th of January. Fukuoka. 13th of February. Hiroshima. 27th of February. Sendai. This is hype actually. <laughs> 6th of March. Nagoya! 12th of March! Sapporo! 19th of March! Niigata! Yeah, these are all locations. Oh, my birthday! Let's go! Kanazawa! Alright, I can, I can participate in this. Let's go. Where is it? Osaka! 2nd and 3rd of March. 9th of March! Okayama! And of course, Dai Bangasai <laughs> is Tokyo once again. Two Tokyo events. Next generation. So are you ready to fight? Damn, that's a hype trailer. That's a very hype trailer. Japan Worlds? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Japan Worlds. <laughs> Alright, here comes everyone's favorite Kidani-san. The creator of Bushiro, the man himself. Alright, so he's, he added the Bakuto, like, title because, you know, next year they want to come back to, like, pre-corona, like, you know, have big IRL events. But I think, like, nowadays, like, these streams are keeping, like, more and more minimal. With, like, you know, because they're every three months. Because even for Rebirth and Vice, the announcements weren't that big. We were alright. The Vice one was alright, yeah. Yeah. Um, like, it's the main thing for white. Alright, so he said, like, um, you know, some of you might be wondering, like, oh, there's no information for Lyrical Set 2 or for the clan collections. So he said, please look forward to the stream on the 4th of January because we really wanted to focus on the anime and the end of season 2 for today's stream. So, yeah, that was their focus for today. Alright, so he also said, like, you know, I'm sure some of you might have, like, some concerns about the like production of the game because it's like you know we're always working hard but there will always be more information on the tuesday streams so it's like this is just between you and i oh so what they worked with yuhodo i think well, like for like test playing for like getting like what production ideas development ideas so i said from like 21st episode of the anime onwards you'll notice like like i i put a lot of like uh advice into it he's helped to make sure that it's like a you know card game anime that like everyone can look forward to watching oh yeah and he's also asking like you know please trust me uh, we're working on some cool stories you know 
取り戻すために、えー So, yeah, he says, like, right now, my work, the number one priority is Vanguard and everything I do. Because he wants to. So, it's like, as I said in the January announcements, it's like, I would never want to rotate again. So he's like, if, if we ever allow Vanguard to rotate again, it's over for me. He says, it's over for me. So we're doing everything we can to never rotate again. So please. So yeah, I want you to enjoy the game and, you know, not worry. So, yes, I, I know there's players that are around for like 10 years already. And, you know, he says, like, you know, whether you're enjoying like the other formats, you know, hope you also enjoy Overdress. Oh, apparently for the card game industry. So I said, like, the, the sales numbers right now for Bushiro's card games are the same, like, you know, the same level of high between Japan and overseas, which is huge. All right, so thank you very much for watching, for tuning in today. Nice, yeah. Kidani always comes on at the end, you know, just to, like, to stabilize the mood, right? To give everyone reassurance. The last word, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, he's the one that's involved in everything. All right, next announcement stream will be on the 8th of March. That'll be the next strategy presentation. The last one that I wake up at 5 a.m. for, man. Crazy. <laughs> After this, it's J JST for me as well. It's uh, Shinobu's voice actress. Shinobu's Seiyu. And we have another guest. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Masanori himself is joining us on this Tuesday stream. Oh, and we have information for the Nation King tournament. Whoa! That's so cool! What? Oh my god! Wow! That's beautiful! So the, the player who gets the most amount of wins within their nation will become the Nation King and receive this Nation King over trigger. Wow! That's beautiful! So if you go to the Animax Cafe uh, from the 17th of December to the 7th of January uh, in Tokyo and in Nagoya from the 6th of January to the 16th of January and you get anything basically if you spend anything between 300 and or like more than 3000 yen i think you get a you get a nice little over trigger oh nice there's another one for team daybreak wait it's not a rival it's not a rival boost it's something else <laughs> and she's like you'll find out the effects of these cards in the anime Unrivaled Bruce, wait, that's so sick all of a sudden. Forget about a rival, it's unrivaled Bruce. Ooh, they have the actual copies on hand. Mm. So that's the Magnolia with her sign on it. Damn, unrivaled, that sounds so cool. Damn, these are these look like SVRs. They look like SVRs, they look so nice. Damn, that's pretty. Oh, the texture is so nice. And like the, the the font, the font is so nice. Oh, and it's textured font too. Whoa. It's a Seiyu sign, Seiyu sign. So first, of course, Maha Nirvana. So if you somehow haven't seen it yet, Maha Nirvana says, Vanguard Circle continues during your turn. If you have a unit in the overdress state, all of your front row units gain plus 10k power. And again, it's a grade 4 with triple drive and does not have Persona Ride. But it's nice because as long as you have one overdress card, your whole front row gets support. It doesn't have to be overdress units. And then once per turn, Kettle Must 1 and choose a Nirvana from either your hand or your soul and put it into the drop. And then choose a grade 0 from your drop. 
call it a rear, and then choose an opponent's vanguard. If they have four or less damage, deal one damage. If Esper Lydia is a great four, then we need to go into this as fast as possible. Ooh, double rare, new order. Yoru Benaki Tamashiyo. Waga Mini Tsudoi. So it's a, it's a normal order, grade two. Uh, choose an order card from your hand and discard it to play this card. Choose your vanguard. For that turn, it gains drive plus one. Damn. Gordo experience. Yeah. All right. Triple rare support for Zorga. Hoko no Gokuryu. In the drop zone. Oh. Uh, when you play a normal order, you may call this card to rear guard circle from the drop. If you did, choose and use one of the following two. If you used Alka Magic, instead of choosing to use one of the following two, do both. So the first effect is for that turn he gains plus 10k power. Second effect is for that turn he gains an extra critical. What the hell? There's no Cano Blast, no Soul Blast, no nothing. Huh? It's free. Oh, it's 5k base. It's a great 3 with 5k base. What? I just saw that. You can call it off the main. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright, next week's plan is... So the new cards introduced in episode 23. Lyrical supplies. So the next lyrical... Uh, like boxes and like sleeves and stuff. And uh, what was the last thing? Oh, the new shop fights. Shop fight stuff. Yeah, I guess they're gonna start introducing V Collection after... I guess it makes sense that they want to finish set 4 first and then go into V Collection. Premium Bro is over because it made me love Premium so much again. Yeah, right. It's kind of sad that that was like that. That was just the Premium Weekend. I wish we had another Premium event soon. Are we getting a 10th anniversary set? Yeah, apparently set 5 will be like a special 10th anniversary set. So, we will probably have some cool nostalgic stuff in it. I'm expecting encounters again. Nice. Good stream, good stream. <laughs> it's going crazy. <laughs> oh my god. Man, yeah, good stuff. Good stream, good stream. We got a little bit of news. Fun fun guests as well. But yeah, today wasn't super news heavy. Super news. Not super news heavy, but it was a good time.